In this video, I will show you how to use the Sendo 3D Walks desktop application. To load a part or a G-code file, click the Load button on the top left-hand side of the window and browse to the model's location, or drag and drop the file into the window. You can import multiple parts into one print job by simply importing the additional parts into the program. To position and scale the part, use the Position, Scale, and Rotation tools on the right-hand side of the window, or right-click on the part for additional tools. To change the mode, go to the Mode menu on the top of the window and select the desired mode. Easy Mode will allow only basic manipulation of the printer functions and settings, while Advanced Mode will allow more experienced users to manually adjust almost all of the print settings. To access the Print Analysis and Optimization tools, click on the part and then go to Analysis. The Optimized Print Direction tool will assist you in choosing the best print orientation to print the part. The Thickness and Overhang Analysis tool will highlight features that are too small to print based on a specified printer nozzle size and, if enabled, all overhangs with slopes exceeding a specified angle. To change print settings, go to the Settings tab on the top left-hand side of the window. Here, you can adjust settings such as the print quality, initial support material applied, and material used. Additional settings, such as email settings and printer model settings, can be adjusted by going to Settings and then Printer Settings. To view and edit the support material, select the Support Editing tool on the top right-hand side of the window. To generate and view the G-code, select the Layer View tool from the top right-hand side of the window. The layers can be viewed by moving the slider bar on the bottom right-hand side of the window up and down, or by using the up and down arrow keys. Once the G-code has been generated, it can be saved by going to File, Save, and then copy to a flash drive for printing. To print the model from the desktop application, click the Print button on the right-hand side of the window. Web monitoring of the default printer can also be accessed by going to Printer, and then Web Monitoring. I hope you found this video useful. For additional resources, click the link below.